to praise God this morning. So many are so preoccupied with other things. He admonishes us to come into his house with praise this morning. That's how we ought to come into the house of the Lord. No matter how we feel, we should give him the glory. We should give him the praise. Let's all stand and let's really sing this song one more time. You are Alpha and Omega. We worship you, O oh Lord. You are worthy to be praised. Zero.
as we continue our praise this morning. The hymn which is chosen is 251 from our hymn now, Rescue the Perishing. softly could we just close our eyes and just raise our hands to heaven as a commitment to God and just one more time just hum the, hum the chorus of that song
lift our hands and just worship the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah, hallelujah. As we worship God, let's think back what our life was like. Oh, hallelujah. And for some of us, salvation came in the nick of time. We were at our wit's end, didn't know just what to do. Oh, and Jesus has made such a difference in our lives. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Oh, God, habits we thought were unbreakable. But when Jesus comes, the tempter's power is broken. Hallelujah. And so as we gather here this morning, we are cognizant of the fact that there are several persons, even in our midst, who are just yearning for Almighty God to do the same for them. So we just want to be focused this morning, just be focused and vigilant, as this church is a saving station. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. At this time, we'll approach the, the throne of grace. And there are several prayer requests. And if you sent in a prayer request, I just want to let you know that someone on the platform praying earnestly for your request. But this one is a, is a special one. It's... Um, Tashai Virgo. She lives off the Walton Park Road. And it says that she was admitted in the hospital because she tried to commit suicide. And her grandmother is asking us to pray for her. You know, that God will somehow save her, rescue her. Let's just lift our hands and just worship God. Remember the name Tashai Virgo. And when we pray, I want you to pray as if it was your only child. As if it was someone you knew. A relative. And just see if we can touch God. Oh, in a special way. We've got to pray as if your life depending on it. Hallelujah. Let's not forget to pray for our sister. Desvin Markey was recovering well, as well as Sister Tiffany Forbes. You know, we know Sister Desvin underwent operation last Sunday morning. So while we were up here praying for her, you know, she was actually being operated on. And the operation was so successful that on Monday, doctor allowed her to walk. And I think by Tuesday, Brother Andrew, she was home. And recuperating very well. Let's lift our hands and thank God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. You know, God performs miracles in different ways. You know, some persons are healed miraculously, instantaneously. But then God actually gives surgeons to remove the obstacle and the body will gradually heal itself. But all praise, honor, and glory goes to God. Let's lift our hands one more time. Don't forget to pray for our country. Pray for those who are hurting, who have lost loved ones and are hurting deeply. And at this time, we're all going to pray together. But Sister Annette Garrick is coming and she's going to lead us in prayer while we pray too. So remember the name Tashai Virgo. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Before we pray, we're going to sing this song without the music. I was thinking deep in sin. There's somebody out there this morning who is depending on our prayer. Hallelujah. And sometimes we need to remember what God has done for us so that we can use that same passion and cry out to somebody. Maybe the person sitting beside you. Maybe you're sending a prayer request for someone. But we are going to sing that song. And as we sing, I'm going to ask us just to close our eyes and connect with Jesus before we pray. I was sinking deep. In sin, far from the peaceful shore, very deeply stained within, sinking to rise no more. But the master of the sea heard. My despairing cry 
lift our hands and thank him this morning. Oh, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Let us all pray. Jesus, we thank you. We thank you for the day that you came into our lives, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. You made all things new. Hallelujah. 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 Cards that were broken. Hallelujah. Start vibrating again. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, for coming down to our level, Lord God Almighty, and for picking us up from the miry clay. Lord God, we were so broken, so destitute. Oh God, so naked, so ashamed. Hallelujah. When nothing else could help, when nothing else, hallelujah. You, God, your love lifted up. Hallelujah, the broken and those who are dying, Lord God Almighty. And we thank you for allowing us to come into your house one more morning. This place that has been consecrated and dedicated to the honor and the glory of your name. Only by grace can we enter. Only by grace can we stand. Not by our human endeavor, but by the power of God. Hallelujah. If you should mark our transgression, who would stand, Jesus? So, Lord, we stand here in need of your grace, in need of your mercy, in need, God Almighty, of your touch upon our life. For without you, God, we are nothing. Without you, we are nothing, Lord. And so we thank you for love, hallelujah, that walk into our darkness and lift us up. And God, this morning we ask that you will wash us and you will cleanse us. Lord God Almighty, for even though you wash and you forgive sins, there are times when we go back, Lord. There are times when we wander off. There are times when we fail you miserably, but for grace. But for grace. Word is not for grace. Hallelujah. So we all stand here this morning, God Almighty, with hands lifted as we cried out to our God in heaven, the God who is able to heal, to deliver, to mend, Lord God Almighty. And in this room this morning, Lord, if there wasn't a need, we didn't just get dressed to come here because it was another Sunday. But we know that in the presence of Jehovah, God Almighty, Prince of Peace, troubles vanish, hearts are mended in the presence of the King. We know that when we come in your presence, oh God, whether here or at home, you make all things new. Lord God, you enlighten our mind. Hallelujah. You lift burden. Hallelujah. And so we cry out to you this morning from this place. Hear us, oh God. Answer our prayer, Lord God Almighty. Jesus, I pray that you will minister to your people. This morning we are gathered here, Lord Jesus. Lord God, there's need for strength, for spiritual strength. There's a need for healing. There are broken hearts sitting down in our midst, oh God Almighty. Oh God, there are those who don't even have the strength to pray for themselves. But thank you, God, that you prayed for us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And as we gather here, we draw strength from each other. I pray you will touch. Lift up the heads that are bowed down, oh God. Strengthen the feeble knees, oh God. Strengthen the feeble hands, Lord. Cause them to raise one more time in your presence. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah! 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 Lord, remember the time when we walked into these doors, when our sins were so heavy. Lord God, we were invited into the house of God and we come with our sins and our brokenness. We were invited to this altar and God, you forgave sin. You fill us with the Holy Ghost and we are now sitting in heavenly places in Christ Jesus. Lord, we are reminded this morning that there are people in our midst who have come broken, heavy laden, sin sick, tired, oh God, of life. God, there have been 
invited to your house this morning. Hallelujah. And we know that the same power that raised Jesus from the dead resides here this morning. And you can raise them, oh God, from their dead situation. Lord God Almighty, you can put the broken pieces back together again. So I pray this morning. God Almighty, that you will touch life. God, say, come by hearing and hearing by the word. Let your word go forth today with power and authority. And like the eyes of your servant, God, that he will not say what he wants, but what does say the Lord. Hallelujah. So that your word can go out and accomplish that which you have sent it, oh God Almighty, hallelujah. Oh God Almighty, come in on me this morning. Bring about change, God Almighty. Break the chains that my people, Lord. Remove the scales, God, that the enemy have used to blind the eyes of our mind. Remove those scales that God let there be a liberty, a freedom to worship. Hallelujah. Remove the heaviness from heart so that we'll be able to express God fresh worship to you one more time Lord God we need you more than ever before we need you God more than ever before more than ever before we need you Jesus our country Lord is crying out hallelujah for light and we are the light and we are the salt and we are gathered here this morning to be strengthened one more time so that we can go out in our communities in our workplaces oh God hallelujah in our schools and make a difference make a difference wherever we go God Almighty, we pray that you will remember our leaders, our government this morning. Lord Jesus, your word said that we're sin about grace, does much more abound. There's enough grace abounding in Jamaica that can transform. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh God, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Every life that will surrender to you. Jesus, have your way in our midst. Take control of the service. Take control of every life, every mind. God, cause our mind not to go wandering off in the service, but that all of us will be tuned, will be connected to what is happening, oh God. Every one of us will be a channel, channel, oh God, through which you can flow and minister to somebody this morning. Have your way, God, in this place as we give you thanks, Lord Jesus. In your name we pray and we thank you for the victory in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise Could we all stand? We'll be reading from Mark chapter 2, verses 13 to 17. Mark chapter 2, verses 13 to 17. Okay. We'll, we'll read together. After 2, 1, 2. And he went forth again by the seaside, and all the multitude resorted unto him, and he taught them. And as he passed by, he saw Levi, the son of Alphaeus, sitting at the receipt of custom, and said unto him, Follow me. And he arose and followed him. And it came to pass that, as Jesus sat at meat in his house, Many publicans and sinners sat also together with Jesus and his disciples, for there were many, and they followed him. And when the scribes and Pharisees saw him eat with publicans and sinners, they said unto his disciples, How is it that he eateth and drinketh with publicans and sinners? When Jesus heard it, he saith unto them, They that are whole have no need of the physician, but they that are sick. I came not to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. Praise God. Could we all lift our hands and just worship the Lord? 
Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God. Before you take your seat, just walk around and greet four, five, six persons warmly. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Warm greeting to especially our visitors. Hallelujah. Welcome to the house of the Lord. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So good to see you. So good to see you. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Praise God. We're in the house of the Lord. And the theme of the service is rescue the perishing. Praise God. And our God has a track record. He has a track record. Rescuing the perishing. Hallelujah. And at this time, Sister Tracy and Campbell coming to sing to the glory of God. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. I just want to say welcome to my mom. Who is here today? Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Let us break up some of the stoniness in this place. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. We bless your name, Jesus. Like the woman of the world. I was seeking for things that could not satisfy. Then I heard my Savior speaking. Draw that shall never run dry like the woman at the well I was seeking for things that could not they could not satisfy but then I heard my Savior speaking he said draw draw from the way that never Lord, I lift it up, Lord, come and quench this thirst of my soul. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. 
friends that are here, this one is for you. There are millions in this world who are craving the pleasures of earthly things afford. But no one can match the wondrous treasures that you, you're going to find today. today to hear just that. Oh, how he loves you and me. Yes, he loves you. It doesn't matter what you're going through. Oh, how he loves you and me. Oh! 
Jesus today. Oh, how he loves you. Lift our hands. We focus on the love of God. Oh, he loves Hallelujah. You. Oh, thank you, Jesus. One more time, hallelujah. One more time, oh how he loves. Somebody. Oh. And God's love is reaching for someone this morning. Spend the next 30 seconds just thanking God for His love. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Oh, God's love is an attribute of God. Oh, God had eternal love, everlasting love, even before you and I were born. Even before you and I committed an act, God loved us. So God's love for us is not an account of the things we have done. Or who we are. God loves us without a reason. Oh, and He loves the saint equally as He loves the sinner. What a God. Because His love is motivated not by anything outside of Himself, but God's love is motivated by all that's in God. What a love. Let's lift our hands one more time. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Thank you, Lord. Loved us when we were unlovable. Loved us without a cause. Hallelujah. Expecting nothing in return, he just loved us. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. And in return, we love him. Because he first loved us. Praise God. You may be seated. Hallelujah. The theme of the service is rescue the perishing. And we just want to thank all the persons who brought their friends, family members, 
to this service. I just want to let you know that within the heart of every man is an urgent need for God. And when this need makes itself felt, then our soul cries out. My soul is thirsting for God. And then we are arrested by Jesus' comment when he said, If any man thirst, let him come unto me and drink. He has a gift for every single one of us here today who are thirsting. And this gift is living water, the Holy Spirit. It's a gift that's sufficient to fill the soul of everyone who is empty. The soul of the emptiest. To quench the thirst of the thirstiest. The thirstiest. And it also can overflow. It's like a well that will overflow. And God wants to rescue someone today. We don't know your situation. We don't know your circumstance. But we don't need to know. But we know a God who has proven himself over and over and over. And he's reaching for you. Speaking to your heart. Knocking at your heart's door softly and tenderly if you listen. And he's calling your name. Because he wants to come in. And have fellowship. Let's just lift our hands and just worship the Lord one more time. As Sister Marsha Powell comes to do the announcements. Praise the Lord, everyone. Can listen to the announcements for this coming week. Um, Sunday today at 6.45 this evening is our evening service. Tomorrow evening at 6 o'clock, there will be a meeting with parents of junior choir members on the first floor north of the administrative building. On Tuesday at 6.30 p.m., meeting with worship ministry leaders in the conference room. And at 6.30, Life Changers Ministry training and development session. On Wednesday, the 12th, 8.30 a.m. is morning manor. 9.30 a.m. Pentup High School prayer meeting, 1 p.m. prayer and fasting service, at 3 p.m. students prayer meeting, and at 6.30 p.m. meeting with prayer ministry leaders in the conference room. On Thursday at 6.30 p.m. meeting with evangelism ministry leaders in the conference room. 6.30 p.m. on Friday, Another meeting with the discipleship ministry leaders in the conference room. On Saturday at 6.30 a.m. is fellowship ministry prayer breakfast for all leaders of Pentab. And the cost is $250 per leader. That's this Saturday, 6.30 a.m. Fellowship ministry prayer breakfast for all leaders at Pentab. And the cost is $250 per leader. Sunday, uh, March 16, 6 o'clock, rightly dividing the word on RGR Fame FM. 7 a.m. prayer time in the sanctuary. 8 a.m. pre-session. 8.30 a.m. Sunday school. 10.15 a.m. worship service, children's church, and a teen tab. 6.45 p.m. evening service. Some upcoming events on March 17, communion, I beg your pardon, community and extension school workers meeting, 18th of March, first youth service for 2014. Everyone, youth service. March 18. Okay then. March 18 again, Apostolic Counselors Association training session. March 19, our first Bible study for 2014. Bible study. Bible study. <laughs> March 19. Okay. On the 20th, meeting with fellowship ministry leaders in the conference room. 21st, meeting with the stewardship ministry leaders in the conference room. On the 25th, meeting with youth ministry leaders in the conference room. 26 is Bible study. March 28 is Golden Ages Club service. And this is to the honor 
Our goal in age was 75 years and over. On March 29, meeting with Life Changers Ministry leaders. And the leaders that are expected, or the leaders who are expected to be in attendance at these ministry meetings scheduled for March 11 to 14, would be the pastoral assistant assigned to the ministry, ministry leader, Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's worship the Lord, everybody. Let's worship the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Let's worship, everybody. Let's worship. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, God. Secretary and the coordinator or person in charge of these sub ministries. The meetings are to be held. The meetings are to look at plans for each ministry and to finalize the calendar of the events for 2014. Our youth are being encouraged to support the Nannyville Outstation Youth Week services scheduled for March 19 to 23, 2014 at 6:30 p.m. nightly. And the services will be held at the Nannyville Community Center. Praise the Lord. And I'm asking all our guests, would you be so kind enough to stand so we can acknowledge you? All our visitors here and abroad. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Don't sit. Don't sit yet, please. A uh, special mention of brother and sister Makala from North Miami. They used to worship here. Are you here? Brother and sister Makala? Okay, praise the Lord. Don't sit yet, folks. The sister of Mariam Brown, Olivia Benjamin from the U U New York. Olivia Benjamin. She's from Judah Temple in the United States. Okay, don't sit here. And Avis Frazier from the United States. Avis Frazier, we'd like to extend a warm welcome to each and every one of you who took the time out to come here this morning. I know there's a blessing in store for you. We're asking you to worship with us. And I'm asking our members to shake their hands wherever we're sitting nearby. We'll sing, welcome. Welcome all of you, glad you are with us, shake hands, no need to be blue, welcome to you, one more time, welcome, welcome all of you, glad you are with us, shake hands, no need to be blue, welcome to you. Richards and family, could you stand for us, please? From Spanish Town. <laughs> Welcome. Let's clap them, everybody. <laughs> Thank you for coming. May God richly bless you and enjoy the rest of the service. <laughs> bless the Lord, everybody. And we also have some other guests that just came. Okay.
we have some students from Dutchess University College in New York just came in. Could you stand so we can acknowledge your presence and give them a Pentecostal round of applause. Bless the Lord, bless the Lord, bless the Lord. So glad that you chose Pentecostal Tabernacle to worship and we know there's a blessing in store for you today. Bless the name of the Lord. Praise God. And we also want to welcome my brother Philip Shea. Brother Shea was in Japan and he's back. Bless you. And I'm sure we are as happy to see Brother, Frey, uh, Brother Shea as I'm um, Sister Winsome. And, oh, all right, she's not. <laughs> Bless the name of the Lord. And we also want to remind you that next Sunday night will be our first citywide crusade. And that will be held in Greater Portmore. It's that open field across the road from the, the complex. So I guess next week we'll tell you. Because I don't know Greater Portmore, different from Lesser Portmore, different from, uh, you know. So next week we'll give instruction as to where. Because I was speaking to someone who lives in Portmore and they are saying which complex. But we heard the complex opposite, you know, that open field opposite some complex. So, but we'll find out next week. So, so give her up. For the first citywide crusade next week, Sunday night, Greater Portmore. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Just turn to your neighbor and just smile with them. Oh, what a beautiful day. What a good day to be alive, to celebrate the worship of Jesus. You know, just to let him know what he means to us, having done so much for us. Praise God. And we had a great um, 68th annual national convention for school you know we give God thanks for all that transpired the several persons who got the Holy Ghost the Holy Ghost rally I think 97 persons got the Holy Ghost on Wednesday in two and a half hours what a God what a God what a God praise God and a little later on we're gonna have our own Holy Ghost rally and everybody here without the Holy Ghost or oh, you can receive the Holy Ghost praise God all right we're gonna continue our worship by giving. Praise the Lord. And I went to a church not too far from here, and when it was announced that it was time for giving, oh, yes, yes. <laughs> when it was announced that it was time for giving, you know, folks began to dance the aisle and speak in tongues. And I said, Oh my God, when are we going to get there at Penta? <laughs> but one day we'll get there. All right, the ushers are here, but before the ushers do receive our gifts, that we're giving to God, Brother Dwight. Neil is coming to do a promotion for Easter rallies. For a world that is destined for destruction, Jesus, the remedy. For every sin sick soul, Jesus, the remedy. For every anguish, every pain, Jesus, the remedy. For every black man and every white man, Jesus, the remedy. For every sick person, for every healthy person, Jesus, the remedy. For the rich man and for the poor man, Jesus, the remedy. For this world, this entire world, Jesus, the remedy. Yes, Jesus, the remedy. And on April the 18th and the 19th, 9 a.m. sharp, we will gather here to worship our Lord Jesus Christ. Because he is the remedy and in connection with this we're asking every one of us to take one visitor just one that's all we're asking one and we will watch them receive what we have because Jesus is Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. 
Praise the Lord. So we'll come bringing our gifts to God. And I implore everyone, come with a smile, please. Let's come joyfully to give to the Lord. At this time, Brother Varden, donor is coming to bless the offering. Our tithes are offering, you know, and our gifts, praise God. Let's bow our heads. Our Heavenly Father, we want to thank you this morning for life, for health, for strength. Thank you, Lord, for the opportunity we have to give to your cause. We are enabled, Lord, by you. We have jobs. We have gifts. And we are here, Lord Jesus, to give back some of what we have received. We ask that you will bless it and use it for the furtherance of your kingdom. In Jesus' name, amen. Praise God. And while the offering has been received, Brother Kevin Powell is coming to lead us in worship. So please, we're marching. So please follow the instructions of the ushers. Praise God. Praise the Lord, everybody. Yeah. Hallelujah. Let's just worship the Lord. Let's continue to give him glory. He lifted me up from the miry clay. He planted my feet on the rock. And that is the reason why I sing and I shout. My Jesus came down, down, down.
reflect on that glorious night it was on the 15th of November 1981 at around five minutes after ten I was just a youngster then when the Lord actually sought for me and found me oh it has been maybe 33 years now thank God and God has kept me oh he rescued me from sin Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, that was some sweet day. Praise God. You may be seated. Praise God. We, we overlooked a visitor. My friend, Mr. Aisha Gordon, could you stand visiting with us? He's from Bethel, born again. Could you give God a praise for her? Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise God. Hallelujah. And before the choir sings, I have got good news. That lady who was praying earlier, you know, God has performed the work that only he can do. God filled her with the Holy Ghost. And we give God thanks. Come on. I think we all should stand to our feet and give God a praise. Hallelujah. 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 Let's join the mighty throng in heaven as they rejoice over one soul that repented oh let's join the party in heaven oh this is why jesus came this is why he died and he's still in the saving business doesn't matter what your situation is your circumstance 
God can be all you think him to be. Can be all you want him to be. And he can be that today. So wait until tomorrow, oh God. The I am. Bless the name of the Lord. We'll continue our worship as a choir ministers to the Lord. Let's lift your hands one more time and just worship the Lord. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Rescue the perishing. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you.
likes you so much.
circumstances may be different our needs may be different but one thing is certain we have a God whose name is Jesus who is able to meet every need and to satisfy the desire of every heart hallelujah hallelujah and I believe that even now he's reaching for individuals here this, after this morning. He knows your circumstance. He knows your situation. And he can do for you in four or five minutes what man can do in an hour. So I don't know your need here today but I know a God who can meet your need and I know a God who is in the rescuing business it doesn't matter how minor your circumstance your situation is God wants to help you so I want to prepare this altar area for any of our visitors who are here you have need for a savior because you're in a situation of distress. The enemy is lurking. And you can't deliver yourself. I know a God who can. Not only will he come and deliver you, but he will take you to a place of safety. If you need a savior today, I just want you to walk to this altar. And those who are beside him, just walk with them. Our God is in the ministering business. Beautiful presence of the Lord. No one can touch you like he can. And just maybe you're here and you don't quite understand what's going on. These are just people who have experienced the love of God. And one songwriter puts it this way. He says, when I think of the goodness of Jesus and all he has done for me, my soul cries out, hallelujah. Thank God for saving me. But if your soul is going to cry out, it has to have a medium to cry out through. So we open our mouths and we shout, we cry, we scream. It's just the love of God. And I don't know your experience. But there's no one individual who can experience all that God has to offer. So I'm calling you to a God. I'm calling you to a new experience. I'm calling you to the baptism of the Holy Ghost. Maybe you have heard of it. But you can come and experience it today. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Is there someone else who needs to come? Just want to talk to this Jesus. Beautiful presence of the Lord. Oh, those who are beside you, just ask them, do you want me to walk with you? Do you want me to walk with you? Praise God. This is a real experience. No and our lives have been so much different. Like Since we were touched by Jesus' hand, no we need some folks to come from the balcony. No one can yes. touch you like Jesus. 
not be afraid, you need no not be bashful. Can give you peace oh, we just want you to experience this joy that we have. No one can oh, Jesus. you. Every burden, he wants to help Jesus you. Jesus can. Nobody can. No one can touch you like Jesus. Jesus can. No one can give you peace. You cannot understand. coming to a God who is omniscient. He knows all things. He knows the minutest detail of the life of every individual. And as you sit or you stand here today, He knows your deepest need. And He knows that the things of this life can't satisfy you. Only a relationship with Jesus Christ can really satisfy. And then this God is an omnipotent God. He has all power. So there's no situation, no circumstance that you're in that this God can't deliver you from. A question was asked. In fact, the Lord in human form in Genesis asked the question, is anything too hard for God? And all through that Bible, that question remained unanswered until Jesus said in the New Testament that with God all things are possible. So you don't have to leave here with your heavy burdens or your circumstance, your situation that you came with. Our God is a great deliverer. And there are many here who can testify. Hallelujah, hallelujah. And just maybe you're a saint and there's something you need deliverance from, you can come also. So our God is in the rescuing business. Rescuing. 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 Thank you, Jesus. No one can touch you like no one. Jesus. Nobody can. No one can touch you like Thank you, Jesus.
Jesus. You Thank you, Jesus. No one can Thank you, Jesus. Ministering to the no broken, ministering like to the hungry, Jesus. those who are thirsty for righteousness, for a change. No one can oh, thank you, Jesus. You oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. No one can find you. Jesus, Jesus, hallelujah, beautiful presence of the Lord, come on, some more saints need to come, draw closer, hallelujah, let's believe God on behalf of thee, yeah, you cannot
and shattered. You are broken inside. You don't have to stay in the shape that you're in. The potter wants to put you back together.
every chain, break every chain. Hallelujah. Jesus name, Jesus name. All the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name, Jesus. All the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name, Jesus name. All the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name, Jesus name, all the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name, all the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name, Jesus name, all the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name, what a name, all the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name is a wonderful name. Name. Jesus name, Jesus name, all the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name, Jesus name, all the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name is a wonderful name. All the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name is a wonderful name. All the power that lies in Jesus name. Jesus name, what a name. All the power.
God Almighty reign.